Carol. This is Fair for All the Food program, and I'm returning your call. Started in March of 1986. A fellow by the name of Mike Port went out to California with his buddy. They went down and they got their groceries, and Mike was very impressed. And he came back to Ramsey Action Program and talked them into starting up Fair Share, at that time is what it was called, here in Minnesota. And California was very dubious about it for the simple reason is that the weather is so cold here, they were afraid that sometimes people would come to pick up and because of the cold weather they wouldn't be able to have a distribution. Well, we've been up now over 22 years, we have never missed a distribution. And we started with about 12 sites, mostly churches in St. Paul, all done by volunteers. Our volunteers are only there once a month to take orders. And the rest of the time we take registration by mail here in New Hope. You can either mail in a check or money order or give us a call with a credit or debit card. They came with mom and dad and the whole family, sometimes the kids wrapped up in blankets, and they came starting at midnight to pick up and then take back up to their host sites as far away as Brainerd and some parts of Wisconsin at that time and Iowa. At that time, they bagged all the groceries. They bagged the potatoes, the onions, and the carrots, and we filled it in with meats and fruits and vegetables that we had gotten from World Chair in California. So that was the beginning of Fair for All. Since then, it has mushroomed into Express sites. It is called Fair for All Express, and it offers fresh meat and produce for all, everyone, regardless of income. And then, of course, here at the warehouse, we have this wonderful store every Monday. Run by the Emergency Food Shelf Network, organizers call Fair for All a kind of traveling grocery store. Good quality food. With boxes of pre-packed meats and produce at 30 to 50% savings over regular supermarket prices. You're completely paying for your own food. It's not a charity in any way. And we find that our typical customer are working families. Anybody who's looking to stretch their dollar a little bit can use this program with fresh, good quality produce. They can visit our website or give us a call to find out what location is closest to them. And we set it up kind of like a mobile grocery store. There are 16 Fair for All Express locations in the Twin Cities area. They are open once a month for two hours. Here's a regular package is $17. That has a variety of four or five frozen meats and fresh fruits and vegetables. They get a lot more quality and quantity than when we started. Now this is a regular package, always. Two pounds of onions, a pound of carrots, five pounds of potatoes. We put in six apples, head of lettuce, three oranges, there was a cauliflower, a package of pea pods. The frozen meats, all the meats come in frozen, for a package of ground beef, chicken breast, brats, and sliced ham. Now the price hasn't really grown that much considering we've been up 22 years. The meat only is 12 and the meat only for $12 would have been the exact same meats. We now have a vegetarian pack, that is 10 that has all fresh fruits and vegetables and then we usually put in, because there is no meat, either pasta or pea pods or rice. You can order as many packages as you want. You can either mail in a check or money order or use a credit or a debit card. I'll be happy to give you our address, 8501 54th Avenue North. New home is 55428. And the name of this program is Fair for All. Hi, this is Fair for All the Food Program. How can we help you? Well, I give out information. Uh, the next time we're at that Olive Branch Lutheran Church, I take the orders and send out the receipts. We take the orders right up until the middle of the following month because the whole site's only there just for two hour increments out of the month. The rest of the time, they rely upon us. And they come early, early in the morning, anytime after 5 a.m. And we have it all ready for them. We have the pick sheets, the people, we have checkers that work in a group and to make sure that the people get no more, no less, the whole sites.
them what they paid for. And because we are a nonprofit agency, we have to be so particular, you know, with the with the increments. A lot of the volunteers that, that keep the whole sites going throughout the area uh, have been with us for over 20 years. And I think that, you know, that that long duration of time says something for a program. And hopefully the young people will be picking up the torch for a lot of these host sites to continue on. Today I have over 50 messages to call back and we call them back just as soon as we possibly can. And we keep right on the recorder the whole thing. Please leave your name, phone number, your county, your town, your zip code, your area code, and then we'll call you back as soon as we can because of the high volume of business. Unless we know exactly where you're from, it takes us a long time to look it up on the map or whatever, and you are really helping us by giving us complete details about yourself.